Hey everyone, it's Connie from Thoughts of Treasures, and today is day 23 of the Ornament a Day November Challenge. And today is not only day 23, but it is also Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving everyone! Today we are going to be making this ornament that I cut out on my Glowforge. It is a Christmas tree ornament, but just not an ordinary Christmas tree. You'll see. So I started by giving the base of this ornament a coat of antique wax, both front and back, just to give it a finished look so that the Christmas tree will stand out better. And we are painting this Christmas tree in white. So yeah, I gave it a couple coats of white to make it nice and bright. And we're going to give that a quick dry. And then I used plaster, which is an off-white color, to do the siding pieces of this tree. This is actually going to be a Christmas tree cake. You all might recognize this. So, so it just gives it a little shadowing effect. Now I did the stripes in red. You'll see me paint those. Now, as we get along here, you're going to see I'm putting it together now. I and I, I went several different directions because when this cut out, let me tell you, the little sprinkles that are for this cake were tiny. So I tried to do several different things and I edited things out and you're going to just see the little sprinkles. But... I tried to do little sparkle, um, I don't know what you want to call them. They're, they were little things I got from the Dollar Tree, little sparkly things. They didn't look right. So I said I ended up going straight back to the sprinkles and messing with them. But my gosh, they were tiny. You will see. But we're going to get all of those glued in. Glued in. Glued on. And here are the tiny little sprinkles. Look at these guys. Yikes. I, I painted each one. It didn't take long to paint them, but then I had to apply them with a little pair of tweezers. This was ridiculously small, but it did look a lot better than the other, the other little things I was trying to use. I can't even think what they're called. They're like little round tinsely things. I don't know, but anyway. So I did finish this off with a hanger and beads, of course. And this is a great ornament for any of those people out there that like this. So if you, this has inspired you, please like, share, and follow.